All right, ladies and gentlemen, um, I've been having this problem with my laptop. I have a HP ProBook 455G1, and my main problem was that I could not do any updates. I know I have Windows 7 on this, but it will not let me do any updates under the uh, Windows Update tab. So I contacted the Microsoft support team and they took control of my computer and the agent that was doing it ended up installing a program on my computer called Tweaking and uh, supposedly was a some kind of Windows update help thing or something, I'm not sure. But um, after he said, let's go ahead and restart it, um, it, it restarted but it ended up getting... Um, just a black screen on it and I couldn't do anything except move the mouse and then whenever I moved the mouse it would just make the screen darker um, I was doing some searching on YouTube and supposedly it's called the black screen of death or whatever a lot of people say to um, you know you can remove the battery and turn it back on and it works or some people say that you can do control alt delete and stuff none of that worked for me um, so what I did was I was just messing around myself. I didn't see this on YouTube or Google or anything. I was just doing it myself. So what I did was whenever I cut the computer on, I kept hitting F8 for it to bring up um, this menu right here. And um, see if I can get that to focus in. It's not focusing in for some stupid reason. It says repair your computer safe mode and all that. A lot of people say go safe mode with networking, but that never worked. So what I ended up doing was I went down to um, last known good configuration. I hit it, and whenever I did, it actually um, it brought up past the little uh, black screen of death or whatever you want to call that. It actually brought it up past that, and I was able to get back into my computer again. Like I said, I'd start it up, it would go through all this, it'd go to a black screen with just a mouse on it, and it would stay there like that. I couldn't do anything, I couldn't hit any buttons, it wouldn't do anything. It would sit just like that until I moved the mouse, and then it would just get darker. But ever since I did that last known good configuration, it actually let me get into my computer. Um, I've already done it before, so it's not doing the black screen anymore. Um... But now, I don't know what's going on with this, but it'll pop up right here to say something about uh, HP security or something like that, biometric scanner, because I got this little fingerprint reader right here. I don't ever use it, but um, so that's how I fixed my, uh, I guess it's a black screen of death. That's how I fixed it, and um, I hope it works for you. Like I said, a lot of people say, I mean, you can try this if it works for you. You can try whenever it goes to the black screen and you can just use your mouse. Uh, nothing else works, though. You can try Control-Alt-Delete. Some people say uh, Control-Shift-Escape. Uh, that never worked for me. Um, so try that. Just if, if your um, computer does the F8 controller or whatever brings up that, that menu, um, go down to last known good configuration and it should start up that helped me i done some searching for probably five hours trying to get this thing fixed and nothing ever worked but as i was saying about the windows update um it still does not let me update my computer for some reason it won't do any kind of windows 7 update or anything like that and um and this is the message, the biometric authentic authentication service is not functioning properly. So I just go log on without it. And then um, it should come right up to, there we go. And that's a little weird because my sound is turned off. And yet it is still making sound. So um, I hope that all works for you. And if it does, please leave a comment saying that it does if it doesn't. Uh, leave a comment and hopefully other people will try to help you out in the comment section. Um, and uh, I appreciate you taking the time to watch the video and uh, thank you so much.